Awesome, great job. Good warm up, everybody. Now we're going to just spice it up a little bit and we're going to go back to our chair and we're going to do a dynamic warm up. So I'm going to turn and I'm going to go back to my chair and make sure I sit safely and we'll talk about what we're going to do. All right. All right. We're going to do a little Richard doing Good Golly Miss Molly. I think it's a really good song for today. Uh, it's beautiful outside, beautiful blue sky today on this particular day, and the trees are ready to flower. We're excited that it's spring. So let's think about just getting our energy level up, and we're just going to think about the extension of our legs, stretch them out there. Yeah, so let's just do stretch. You can put your hands on your on your waist, or you can put your, hold onto your chair. As always, make sure your space is free of clutter. Only do as much as you feel you're able to with this exercise. So if you want to change any portion of the exercise to make it easier for yourself or to just take, take it down a notch and just do it your speed, all good, not, not a problem. Well, with this dynamic uh, warm up, we're trying to just now after a slow, smooth warm up for the spine, um, to try and, and get our heart rate up just a little bit and to try and facilitate the collaboration between our cardiovascular system from top to bottom. So we'll move our body with a little bit more energy. Heel, so heel strike is a big one. So as you're gonna go doing your walking this summer with your favorite tune, make sure you practice a really good heel strike. So just make sure you feel that heel strike. And I'm still wearing my bare feet as I will for this whole series of exercises so that I can really just feel. We're gonna do one, close, two, close, three, close, four, close. Then we're gonna touch the side, wherever it's comfortable for you on the side. Remember, we've talked about keeping the weight on that sit bone. That is the supporting side, super important. Out, close, out, close, out, Close, out, close, and let's do a little of everything. Once and twice, then out, then in. Yeah? And if you mess it up, it doesn't make any difference. Just keep your body moving. Then we have a little fun bit where we're going to practice just being a, a star. We're going to make our starfish. We're going to go up and up, then out and out. So imagine you're thinking about that star shape and you're gonna to reach to the top corner of your square and here and here and here. And if you can use your eyes, that would be super good. Eyes have muscles too. And then we're going to go into marches. We're just gonna march, yes. And this is just seated just to get ourselves warmed up and just to get our heart rate up just a little bit. Yeah, good. And then we're gonna think about always coming back so when we come back to that ta-da moment we're going to do that same movement again yeah now we're going to start again and we're going to do heels but this time we're going to think about our arms so you don't have to do your arms but it's good to work on the coordination of the spiral especially for lots of walking do you want to have a really good spiral action connect yourself from the top of your head to the tip of your toes so you have a really good gait when you're walking so uh, you know, just get that little practice and see, yeah? So if we go forward with our hand on the opposite side, yeah, four of those. And then if you feel energetic, go up in that space. So take one arm up into the upper space when we go to the side, yeah? And then we can do again, yeah, we can do two or we can just, it depends on the music. Maybe that's all. But every time we have that little pause, we're gonna go up, up, and then down, down. Yeah, then there's gonna be an improv section. I just want you to feel like you can just groove it out and just snap your hands, you can clap your hands, you can do whatever you like. When we do our introduction section to this, we're gonna clap our hands. I want you to reach anywhere you can go. Yeah, imagine that you're in the classroom and you're gonna clap, wake them up, wake them up, wake them up. Make sure you make, get their attention, give them a smile, and just clap all around, imagining our big circle in front of us so that we can keep sharing all of our joy together. We're gonna do all of that re 
repeat it again, yeah? So it's not gonna be hard to remember, but it's just gonna kind of diversify a little bit. And at the end, you need a ta-da, yeah? You need to have a little ta-da moment. Okay, so here we go with the music. And I think it's ready, so here we go. Start by clapping anywhere.